Hello, in this video we work on the delete part and we have one more endpoint to go which is find by find a particular book and then you head over to react and then make that request from react instead of Postman. So let's get started. So what you are going to do in this video is to create a delete endpoint to delete a book. So let me say book router dot delete. That is a HTTP message I'm going to use delete. And you also need the ID of the book. So let me wrap everything with the Express Async Handler package we installed in the previous video. And here will be async. I'll mark it as async and write the response. And then I will say that first I can make try and catch methods here. So first let me say const. Let me make try and catch here. And then I'm gonna find the book by ID. So const which say book is equal to a weight and then um, book and then on that I will find by ID and delete as simple as that and the ID is inside rec dot um, dot ID right so for that matter I will say that rest dot status and I will say everything was okay and I will just send rest dot send mm, back the book. No, maybe just send back the book that was deleted, right? So I will just say rest dot send, um, then which will be two hundred, right? Which means okay. So this method, and if there is any error here, I will just say um, rest dot send. The adjacent here, and I will send back the error. All right. So for this, I need the ID of the book, and then just to delete. I don't want to return back the book that was deleted. But for the meantime, let's return. Okay, the book. I but normally you don't return back the book. I can just do this one, then return an empty um, response or just two hundred everything. Okay. All right. So let's head over to Postman and make that request. So let me create another endpoint. Another uh, request here. Let me label this one as what? Delete. And the request is delete here. And I need the ID of the book. So let me fetch all the books here and see the one I want to delete. The religion part, the original one. Okay. I have some programming tool here. I don't want that. So let me delete this one programming tool part here. Let me come delete and then provide it as a second. And then which is delete here let me save it and then make the request as you can see it has been deleted so let me come out to fetch and then fetch again if this one still exists as you can see it's nowhere to be found right guys so that is how we implement the delete part of our book endpoint so in the next video we will start working on the client part of our application